What is up, ladies and gentlemen? We're back here for yet another episode, and uh, in today's video, it's it's actually going to be a travel vlog, and uh, me and my dad, uh, we're actually here about to leave. I'm getting a very late start on the day, but I'll, I'll tell y'all why it's exactly 4:35 right now, and uh, we're we're about to head down to the FLW Forest Wood Cup down on Lake Ouachita in Hot Springs. It's uh, it's about three and a half to maybe three hours and 45 minute drive from where we are right here. And uh, I'm packing up pretty much. So I've got my suitcase right down there that has like all my clothes in it. I've got my com computer bag right there. And this is all my fishing fishing stuff. So I'm gonna go quickly through what I'm gonna take. The thing is, is I'm not going down there exactly to fish. I'm going down there to have a good time, to see the tournament, and uh, this is like the biggest tournament, like in my, like kind of in my area, I guess, um, or within like a good, decent, like not too far driving distance. Um, this is a pretty decent sized tournament, and I, I went to this tournament, uh, I believe two or three years ago last time it was hosted there and that is actually my very first video on my youtube channel if you guys go back and uh see my very first video it is actually uh me holding up at my gopro uh and it's literally all it is is you watch the pros weigh in their fish and there's no intro there's no outro it's super crazy um but that that was kind of like where I started my channel almost, you know, that was my first video. So I'm going back there because they're hosting the tournament once again. FLW, FLW Forest Book Cup today is Friday. You guys are seeing this tomorrow on Saturday and uh, going to be doing lots of videos down there. But if I find a good pond or a creek or something that I want to fish, then I've got some tackle with me. I'm going to take two rods, a spinning rod and a bait casting rod, um, both 13 fishing to five blacks and yeah so let me show you the tackle I've got a mystery tackle box pro right here this is the August box um, if you guys haven't checked out the uh, the video where I unbox this sucker the the link might be in the description I'm not sure but I've got the duck the crankbaits poppers proc uh, prank yeah there we go uh, the soft plastics all that good stuff We've still got in there. Next, I've got my little bag of plastics right here. I've got some drop shot baits in here, just in case I'm feeling a little bit finessey. Uh, I've got some Cinco's, some jig trailers, some flipping baits, and a little wacky rig deals. So that's pretty much like literally all the plastics I'm taking. If I need some, I'll go buy some. Next, I've got this box right here. This has some spinner baits in it, some crankbaits, square bills, jigs, and some stuff to do Texas rigs and that kind of stuff. Then we have my day box. This has chatterbaits in it, uh, whopper ploppers, top water, frogs, liftless crankbaits, square bills, jigs, swim jigs. It's got a lot of stuff. So, and then obviously I've got my hook, or not my hooks, but uh, uh, what are those things got pliers and scissors and a scale. I've got all that stuff too. And I'm actually also taking my inflatable kayak. If you guys didn't know, I had a inflatable kayak. Um, and so we're actually where our hotel place deal is. Um, it's on Lake Hamilton. And you, if you guys know that area, Lake Ouachita and Lake Hamilton, they're like right next to each other. And uh, Lake Hamilton is actually um, like a more recreational lake. And then Lake Ouachita is like the fishing and uh, that kind of stuff, that kind of lake. Um, but we're actually staying on Lake Hamilton, so I'm not too sure if I'm going to go fish there. But if I do want to get out on the lake, there's a little cove or something, I can go put my kayak out there and try to catch some fish. But I'm not too sure about that. Yeah, really not too sure. So, anyways, I'm going to pack all that fishing stuff back and uh, go put them in my dad's car. Alright guys, so we just got everything 
packed up in the back there. We started a car and uh, we are now on our way first. I think we might have to go, oh yeah, we gotta run to the bank first and then, then we're gonna be on our way to Hot Springs, Arkansas for the FLW Forest Wood Cup. All right guys, so me and my dad, we have pulled off almost to the side of the road right here and uh, I've got this amazing view right here back behind me. I'm gonna get a couple dope pictures, but I asked you guys on Instagram to uh, to send me some questions and I'm gonna put them in my recent, in, a, in today's video, so that's what I'm doing today. Um, sorry if you guys can hear like cars driving by, there's like the road is literally five feet away. So uh, the first question is, uh, when did you start bass fishing? Uh, this is by Logan uh, Lou Beaker. I'm sorry, man. I pronounced mispronounced your last name. I know that. Um, I've been bass fishing a little bit, like a little bit here and there all throughout my life. But when it really started to kick in was probably like two, two and a half years ago. And I just found like a deep passion for it. And uh, this is pretty much what it's become. Um, next one is Bass Slayer 2000. What is my PB? My PB is actually five pounds. I'll put a picture up on the camera or on the screen right now, but it's five pounds and uh, I caught it flipping under a bridge. Um, next one is by J. Russell Mall. Um, how long did it take you for your YouTube channel to start picking up? I would say this summer is when it really started picking up really once I got out of school and kind of spring break in that kind of time frame um, because that's really when I started pumping out uh, trying to pump out quality content with my parents camera and now I have my own camera um, and uh, I was posting more often like maybe a couple times a week during school weeks and then during summer like this summer I posted almost every day so that's that's a good tip for you guys who are wanting to start off is consistency and try to post good quality stuff um, so um, let's see the um, next one is do you like catching bass on lures or bait that's by Branson Spartan I think um, I mean, I normally use the lures. If you're talking about bait, um, I think you would be talking about like live bait or something like that. I don't really use live bait. I want to do a live bait versus uh, like artificial bait coming soon. So you guys stay tuned for that. Comment down below if you guys want me to do a video about that. So that's pretty much all for today's Q and A. But uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna run over here again, back behind me. It's super dope. And I'm gonna get a couple dope pictures and then we're gonna get back on the road. All right guys, so we have arrived at the Home to Suites in, what city is this? Hot Springs, Hot Springs Arkansas. Um, we're, we're actually on Lake Hamilton. Like, you guys can't see it because it's dark time, or nighttime right now, but like, the lake, like Lake Hamilton, which is like the recreational lake and everything, it's it's literally like right over there and a boat rental place is like right over there so um, that's pretty sweet we're gonna go inside check in get to our room and uh, then we're gonna go grab a bite to eat so I'll catch you guys in our room or doing doing something else like that alright guys so we're gonna end today's little uh, little travel day vlogging for you guys uh, we're gonna end it right here it is uh, let me let me see what time it is. It is exactly 11:23 p.m. and uh, I'm ending the video right here. I've got to get to bed, go take a shower, get to bed, and then so I can wake up early tomorrow morning for the uh, for the takeoff. Like when all the pro fishermen like go out to uh, their first spot in the morning. So I can go film that for you guys, get some pictures, and uh, yeah, I might go fishing tomorrow morning. Not completely sure. We'll just we'll just have to see. But anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. If you guys haven't already, go subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next episode of LMB Nation. Peace, guys.